Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I want to join uh, many of my colleagues who came to the floor yesterday to recognize that uh, this coming Monday, June 10th, is the 50th anniversary of the Equal Pay Act being signed into law. <clears throat> With that said, uh, even after 50 years, we're still waging the same battle for women. The historic anniversary is a reminder that there's much work to be done to close the wage gap. Equal pay for equal work is about fairness for women and families and dollars and common sense. For working mothers who have to put food on the table and the retired women whose income is tied to their former salary, the wage gap means real dollars. In South Florida, if the wage gap were eliminated, a working woman would have enough money for 51 more weeks of food, three months of mortgage and utility payments, or five months of rent, or more than 1,600 additional gallons of gas. And Mr. Speaker, whether you serve customers in a, in a retail, local retail store or argue cases before the highest court, uh, you have a right to be treated with fairness and dignity. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker.